What's up everyone? It's Natalie here and today I am filming a huge fall haul for you guys and I have not filmed a fall haul or just a haul in general in so long. I honestly don't remember the last time I filmed a haul video. I feel like all my channel consists of now is vlogs and I'll do little mini hauls in my vlogs but I actually have tons of new items so I wanted to just sit down and do a haul for you guys and show you guys everything that I got for the colder months in New York but also a lot of these things I'm now realizing are also you can wear in the summer but they're just so cute so I want to show you guys and I know a lot of you don't necessarily live in places that it's cold all year round so if you guys are watching and you guys live in like Miami or something like that don't worry there's stuff for you here too anyways I am just gonna jump right into the video if you guys are new here my name is Natalie keep on watching if you like this video thumbs up subscribe all of that good stuff but yeah I'm just gonna jump in and show you guys the clothes I feel like I feel like I just like completely forgot how to film a haul now so here we go the first item is this Zoe Reba dress I'm gonna show you Zoe Reba first it's actually a store in Miami they have a showroom in Miami but it's an online store and I think it is so freaking cute this is definitely very summery but I actually pictured this with like a white turtleneck underneath and then um, like knee-high riding boots and a leather jacket I think this would be really cute and you can definitely transition it to fall because of like the burnt orange color but Zoe Reba is an online store and I actually interviewed the owner Zoe on my podcast she I think was the second episode actually and her story is really cool so I'm gonna have that link down below but I just love supporting her and supporting her business and if you guys want to shop any of this of course I'll link it down below but yeah she's just a great girl um, she's our age and she designs all of this stuff and creates it and sells it online and she's just a complete boss so if you guys want to shop her and support her as well you guys can or if you're in Miami um then you guys can actually like go to her showroom and shop it in person but yeah I love this outfit so the next thing I have been looking for the top everywhere because I have just been accumulating these items um as I've like wanted to film a haul and this one is a set but I cannot seem to find the top so I'm gonna insert a picture of me wearing it and then also like a picture of it on the site but it's this really really cute black set I think it's adorable and I just love sets so I'm going to be looking for that top but if not honestly you can wear the skirt plain but yeah I'm just like obsessed with sets and because it's black you can wear this with leather you can wear tights you can wear it with boots like it doesn't matter this next dress is adorable as well this is like a leopard print like a very muted leopard print it's a long sleeve which I really really like and cinches at the waist and it's just super feminine and girly which is what I love about all of her products is they're really really feminine I just think that they're so flattering so yeah I just like really really love this dress and it's just a perfect like muted leopard print it's not super loud and obnoxious and I like it because you can like tie it right here so you can still like kind of adjust the way it fits you and then the next dress is one from Zoe Reba as well and it's this navy blue floral dress I think this one is gorgeous it's really ruffly at the bottom and also long sleeve and I just think it's so so beautiful and this one's definitely one that I will be wearing in the winter I feel like you can definitely wear this with tights as well but honestly I sacrifice <laughs> for the winter sometimes just to, like look cute so I'll still wear like a dress but maybe I'll put like a coat on when I'm walking outside but yeah I just really 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 love this outfit I think it's beautiful and then the next thing is this top and my little sister is actually visiting me right now so I might show her this so that she can get her own because it is like UNC blue colored and it's so cute so I feel like this top I have been looking for a top that like ties in the middle like this and it's just really loose and feminine and I think this is adorable with like the long sleeves and they're like the balloon sleeves so they cinch at the um, wrist and they're just like really really flowy I love this I think I'm gonna wear this sometime this week and get some photos in it because I'm really trying to style um, all of these outfits and like get photos and post them on Instagram because my Instagram game is lacking you guys so gotta do that the next thing is this top I think it's really fun I don't wear a lot of color so you guys probably can tell even in this haul so far like the most color I've gone is blue and it's been very like muted or navy you know so it's like still kind of can count as a neutral so this is a very very out there top but I actually think it's really really cute it's not the most fall top but I just had to get it because I thought it was adorable it's this cropped long sleeve top and it has like a tie at the bottom of it and I just think it's so 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 nice so 
I love it. I really love it. If you guys can give me ideas on how to wear this in the fall, let me know. But I go to Miami every single Christmas as well. So I'll definitely be packing some of these there. Because, like, the long sleeves make it sit so that it's not super summery. But still, like, let me know how you guys would style this. So I think that's it from Zoe Reba. So now I'm going to go into my Brandy Melville goodies. So the first thing is this long sleeve top from Brandy Melville. I really, really like it. I think Brandy Melville is just great for, like, basic pieces pieces that you can kind of wear and like layer and dress up or dress down like I feel like they're definitely more casual but I really like this This could be a good undershirt you could wear this with um like leather and dress it up or you can make it super casual with like boyfriend jeans it's just a good long sleeve top I mean it's gonna be cold outside this isn't like oh my gosh I love your top where'd you get it but it's comfortable it's nice enough and <laughs> it's gonna keep you warm because it is a little bit thicker of a material the next thing from Brandy that I love is this giant t-shirt that says New York on it. I think it's just so cool and cute. So I really, really like this. Um, it's just a big t-shirt. Honestly, you can probably go to Goodwill and find something very similar to this. So if I were you and I were a little smarter than me, then go to Goodwill and find yourself a t-shirt like this. But I didn't have the patience to do that and I just found it there. And I think it's like $16 or something like that. It might be a little more expensive the tag ripped off but it's not that expensive and i just like really liked it especially being here living in new york the next top from brandy is this knitted sweater i really like this or i don't know if it's knitted but it's like a really thick um material i think it's ribbed is what it's called yeah it's a ribbed sweater and it's just cropped so you can wear it with some high-waisted things and also it has buttons on the top so i think it's really really cute and i've worn this you guys four times and I bought it like two weeks ago and I've worn it four times. It's already gone through the wash once. So like I have been living in this. It's just the most basic and most comfortable t-shirt. And then the next thing from Brandy, which I've already worn, which actually is dirty. So I'm going to have to wash this, but I still wanted to show it in the haul is this um white t-shirt so it is a little dirty it has like makeup stains on it because i've already worn it and i wore it to the pumpkin patch so it was just like outside all day but it's really really cute um i like this like the neckline of it and it's just another basic white tee that's like pretty inexpensive so if you're looking for like good inexpensive pieces i think brandy is a good one to go to for just like basic items and then another basic thing that I got is just this plain gray t-shirt from Brandy. Again, you can go to Goodwill and probably find something like this. I just like didn't have the patience and I was in Brandy Melville at the time, but it's pretty inexpensive as well. So I just got a plain basic gray tee that I could use for layering or just like lazy days in. So now I'm just going to show you guys a few like random items. Um, they're not like all from the same store. This is from Lush. So Lush is like a wholesale brand. Um, this was actually gifted to me, but it is this bodysuit. So it's a bodysuit, but it has like a cutout in the middle and it's all velvet. So I think that's really cute that it's velvet with the cutout. I'm going to a concert next month and I think I'm going to wear this with some black jeans to the concert. I think that would be a really cute outfit because it's still wintry because of the long sleeves and the velvet, but you still like show a little bit of skin. So I think it's really cute. And then this dress, I think it's so fall, and I actually got it in a size medium because they didn't have my size, and I just really, really wanted it. I think it is so cute. It's from All In Favor. All In Favor. Yeah. And it is this really long floral, like, fall print dress. I think it's so, so cute and fun, and I really want to get some pictures in this. And because it was just, like, a straight dress, it's not, like, fitted at all, I was like, okay... I don't need to get a small I could get a medium so I'll let you know how it fits if not I can always like belt it or something but I just thought it was too cute not to get because I don't have anything like this this is very like not my style but I really liked it and I was drawn to it and I wanted to try something different so that's why I opted for this but I think it's like really really cute and it's a midi so it doesn't go all the way down to the floor but it's just a really cute look I feel like this with sneakers will be really cute and then the next thing is just a plain classic sweatshirt. So this is actually from Aloe and it's just this gray sweatshirt. I liked it because it wasn't that thick. So you're not going to be like sweating in it because it has that like um, that material. I don't know if you guys can see on the inside. It's not like that soft material. So I just really liked it. I feel like it's a good sweatshirt that you could dress up because it's like cropped, hemmed at the bottom and then the sleeves are just a little looser and they're like ripped at the bottom so it just adds a little bit more style than like a typical classic sweatshirt so i really really liked it and this one is from aloe 
if you guys can't tell i've also been just trying to wear a lot more basic pieces and dressing those basic pieces up a lot because i don't know i feel like that's what i'm more like attracted to now like whenever i see outfits that i really really love it's always like super simple super basic pieces but just dressed up with like jewelry or like a jacket or sneakers or something like that so i think that that's like what i'm kind of gearing towards as I pull out the most extra jacket. So ignore everything I said about being basic and now be prepared for the most base or the most extra things that I got from Blank NYC. Okay guys, so <laughs> I don't know where this is gonna fit because do you see that? My closet's already full and then that coat rack is full. So I don't know where this stuff is gonna fit. But you know what? It's been sitting on my chair for about two weeks waiting for me to film this and then I'm just gonna figure it out from there. But anyways, it is this gigantic coat of this is all faux fur. If there's any fur on any of these things, it's all fake and it's all faux leather as well. But yeah, it is this giant leather fuzzy coat. I feel so New York like stepmother in this. Like I feel like Cruella de Vil or something like that. But it is this not insane? <laughs> what? I don't know where this is going to fit, but I just like had to have this. And I figured New York is the place to wear this. It's the only place acceptable to wear this, I feel like. So, yeah, I thought this was so cool. And it's part of their new collection. And, yeah, oh, my gosh. It's belted also, but it's just so nice. And it's also so heavy. Like, I can never travel with this. Oh, it's probably like five pounds. <laughs> and then I got this jacket from Blank NYC as well. It's the snakeskin, which it is fake snakeskin, you guys. Fake snakeskin, um jacket with fringe i thought it was a really cool piece that i can take some pictures in and also just dress up one of my basic outfits so it has fringe all on the back and this stuff is not normally my style but when i saw it i was just like i think i can have fun with this and i want to branch out more i feel like when i'm living here i know you guys are tired of me talking about new york so much but like i'm sorry it's just it's gonna be talked about when i'm living here i want to like expand my style and just be inspired by people around me and be inspired by what other people are wearing and just like the streets and street style and people here just dress up so cool and it's really it gives me um i want to step out of my comfort zone so i thought that this was a cool one to wear with like all black so still not crazy but you know a little more fun and then also this extra baby <laughs> this one's definitely still more my style it's just a lot so it's like big fuzzy cheetah um fur cheetah faux fur cheetah coat um it's all long really cute it has like the cheetah print up top or leopard print i actually don't know is that bad <laughs> um just white fur and then again the other another print on the bottom so i think this is really really cute and then again like on the sleeves too i think it's a cool coat to have and it's definitely going to keep me warm this winter and as you guys can see the pile is growing behind me and then last but not least this is probably the most out there thing as well probably the first jacket from like nyc and then this is like my most extravagant thing yet but it is this it looks like a raincoat but it's not a raincoat um trench coat snakeskin faux snakeskin trench coat it's red hot faux trench coat like give me outfit ideas you guys i just saw these and i was like i really 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 want to get out of my comfort zone and be different this winter and now's the chance to do it so that is why i got all of these um i'm really excited to wear them so give me ideas send me some ideas dm me any ideas that, like if you see someone wearing something like this like send it over to me because i'm not quite sure but I just want to expand my style. So that is kind of what this haul was. Like me getting out of my comfort zone. So yeah, I think that this is so cool though. And I really, really, really love it. Also, everything that I had will be linked down below. And I also want to mention that if you guys want anything of mine, just like that I use a lot in my vlogs or in my videos or anything like that, I'm always going to have my Amazon store down below so that you guys can find um, easy access to that. So like any books that I've been reading, anything that I've been purchasing lately, if you guys are just always curious, not just on this video, then you guys can find links to that on every video description of mine starting around now. Um, and then also everything that I have right here will be linked down below as well. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this haul. It's been really fun finding all these pieces and it's gonna be really fun styling them so i'm excited for that but let me know if you guys liked it and if you guys want more hauls from me instead of just incorporating them into vlogs if you guys like these like dedicated videos just let me know and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys